Uh, my name is Ryan Shannon. I'm a dispatcher with uh, San Mateo County Public Safety Communications. I've been a steward for 13 years or so. Now I'm the president of Local 829. Sheriff's Office, Ryan. Well, I'm a 911 dispatcher, so um, we answer fire, medical, police calls. Um, we dispatch the police, fire, medical units. We organize uh, mutual aid for other counties, for our county. Um, basically, if you call 911, we're the ones that answer. Yeah, I mean, I can have them come out there and talk to you. Well, Ask Me Local 829 covers basically all San Mateo County workers. Uh, we cover uh, agencies from Daly City all the way to Memo Park and everything in between. Um, we cover nurses, dispatchers, social workers, park rangers, you know, everything in between. It's important to have a union for too many reasons to name, but on the on the lower level in my department, for what I do as a dispatcher, I'm one dispatcher. Um, we our job is so stressful and intensive that you know any call could be your last call. So um, it's important to have you know a strong union, a strong uh, membership because um, mistakes happen every day, and it's not your fault. It's not in, on purpose, but you need someone there to kind of guide you through the process. We also voted um, to donate $150 to the San Mateo Labor Council Union Food and Toy Drive. I have their flyer here as well if anybody on that side. When I got involved in the union, I, I got involved because I saw uh, things that I didn't like. and I didn't see a strong voice in the department or really in the county. The union was an afterthought. It was kind of... Uh, you know, looked upon as uh, something that you just had to do as a procedure more than a uh, willing participant. So I wanted to change that and I tried to instill that into my kids. Uh, I bring them to events whenever I can. I have a daughter that's 13 and a son that's 7 and, you know, my daughter obviously understands more than my son does, but I think it's important for them to know that, you know, that you treat people fairly and, and people, everybody deserves the same rights and things like that. I think those are basic tenets of raising good children and there's a basic tenets of having good employees and members and so I fight for that and I hope they see my efforts in general. I mean, um, it seems that you know people don't uh, appreciate that we had to work hard for our benefits, we had to work hard for fair wages, we had to work hard for decent health care, things like that. They think uh, we get that for free or that it's somehow uh, that we're greedy for asking for those things and I, as a union uh, member, as a president, I want the message to be that everybody should have that. You should want that for yourself, not just be fighting against people that have it. So whether you're in a union job or a non-union job, those are the kind of things you should be striving for. So I hope, I hope we can turn the narrative because um, it's been damaging lately and we seem to only hear one side of it. But you know we do great work every day. Um, everybody that, that we represent are the people that don't go unnoticed, but they do it for the right reasons, and hopefully that's gonna that will win the day.